Hey, what's up? Uh, today is November 7, uh, 8, November 7, 2018. It's 8.57 a.m. And, you know, I, I just got out from work about 8 hours ago and I haven't slept yet. Because I'm gonna try to adjust on my job which I start today at 10 p.m. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drink this uh, right there that one cup 30 uh, milliliters uh, Zequil it's a sleeping sleeping aid sleeping liquid and it's almost nine so my plan is to sleep uh, nine and a half hours so excuse me I wear these things because my hair is messed up I just got out from shower about five six hours ago so I'm gonna drink this now okay here we go and this one is gonna knock me out so I can sleep for about nine and a half hours wake up at 6 30 p.m. and then start work at 10 p.m. okay here we go Uh, uh, you know it tastes like wine I didn't feel the heat going going here so yeah okay it's almost 9 o'clock and then I'll be laying down on my bed over here and I will wake up at 6 30 p.m. and then I'll give you update what happened on my job when when I start uh, tonight so 9 point 9.5 hours of sleep okay adios hi what's up today is november 7 2018 around 9 or oh, 8 8 uh, 49 pm right there yeah so I will start at my new job at 10 p.m. as a security guard in a hotel and actually I didn't show up at work today and I already sent an email to my supervisor but the funny thing is the supervisor did not show up at work today so I don't know and maybe st I still have little bit of hope if I don't like this job maybe I should just go back you know tomorrow so I decided not to bring this camera because on my new job as security guard in the hotel we are not allowed to uh, take breaks on cars so means I cannot film and you know so I will just leave this camera at home and when I got home and when I have time then I'll give you an update on what happened or if I like the job or not so we will see today I will get my utility belt and my uh, uniform and we'll see what happens in this one day if I like it or not I'll actually be home at 6 in the morning uh, that, I mean my ship ends at 6 in the morning but when I got home I don't know maybe it will take longer maybe I'll be here at 7 or 8 in the morning I don't know so yeah so I, I have to leave at 9 o'clock so I, I want to give myself at least an hour before the job starts so in case of traffic you know I will not be late and they're shutting down the freeway at 9 p.m. in here so maybe I will not able to use that freeway let's see okay then uh, I'll give you I'll, uh, I will update you and see you after many many hours later Okay then, today is November 7, 2018, 8.50 uh, p.m. And the next time I go back here, it's going to be November 8, probably morning time or night time. Okay then, adios. Oh. Hey, what's up? Today is November 8th, 8.48 p.m. and I just finished my 8-hour work yesterday and you know it was really a long story 
uh, you know they give me the utility belt and everything but right now this is my uniform right here yeah 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 I do look like a sheriff or a police officer but gotta be honest you know I'm very worried about my other job in Hive and I don't know if they will I don't know what will happen so I'm gonna communicate with my boss today I don't know if he gonna fire me or you know if he going to I don't know what he going to do with me so yeah so if, if things goes bad in Hive if I communicate with my boss then what I will do is I will return all this equipment and I will go back because I don't think that you know I, I like the job I, I don't feel comfortable for now I mean, it's my first day maybe the second day I'll be better but the one who's training me is just gonna be there for today and then tomorrow is uh, on vacation returning on Monday so I'll be working with the boss my security boss and that's gonna be a big problem because you know it's kind of intimidating to work with okay then adios hi today is november 9 2018 it's around 6 58 a.m yeah and I just got out from work almost an hour ago and this is my day two and the good news is you know the supervisor had confirmed me that my vacation is okay and my other job at Hive and this is my day two of my security job as you can see and if you can see the form and everything you know utility belt and everything yeah so I had a training with my supervisor for the last two days and tomorrow I will be working with my CEO, my big time boss, the owner of this security company and I'm nervous to work with him of course because he's the boss and and you know I don't know how you know how he runs things but and I have what Saturday Sunday I'll probably be by myself or maybe tomorrow I'll be by myself you know I yeah I already went to the hotel routine and you know doing the express tags and you know and everything yeah so I'm kind of tired and but I'm giving you an update so right now I'm more relaxed because you know the the other job I have had approved my vacation so I have one more week to decide if this is the job for me or not otherwise I'll be back in Hive building chassis servers and uh, and you know and seeing that never mind okay then adios I'll keep you updated the uh, Tomorrow, you know, as the day goes. Bye. Hey, what's up, YouTuber? Uh, what's up? Hey, what's up? Today is November 9, 2018, and it's around 9 8 p.m. And I'm about to start at 10 p.m. So I'm in a hurry and today is day three working as a security job and I've been working five days including the two days in Hive and I'll be working another two days you know so the whole week I'm working and then Monday Tuesday I will be off so I'm kind of tired and I feel sloppy but maybe later on when I'm working alone at the job security site if my training is over then maybe I'll bring this camera and you know show you around on, on the job site on what, what kind of place I'm patrolling but for now uh, November 9 2018 9 9pm 9 and when I go back I'll be out 6 in the morning and probably when I film it's gonna be Saturday morning already of November 10 but anyway I'll keep you updated day 3 adios
Hey, uh, today is November 10, 2018 and it is 10.41 a.m. And I actually just came out from work 6 a.m. You know, from November 9. But, you know, I came out 6 a.m. of November 10 so I need to sleep and then go back to work again. Uh, yeah. Uh, I was actually my boss went there and he just took some uh, some of my paperwork and probably and then I, I work alone so it's kind of yeah it's kind of I don't know what to say but but I believe you know since I'm working alone maybe today tonight I can bring this camera and you know uh, record everything you know where like what what my patrol look like and everything my routine so let's see I will decide tonight okay then I want to sleep I'm tired adios Hey, what's up? Uh, I'm gonna do my patrol. So this is the hotel construction, as you can see. It's very dark in here. Oh my God, this feels like ghost adventures over here. So this is the area I patrol. Make sure nobody is inside. There. It's kind of scary though. I'm gonna walk this hallway. There's supposed to be nobody here. If someone is here, then I have to shoot them and kill them. So, I have to observe. If anything, someone is here, then man, I have to. Okay. God. So, yeah, as you can see, I'm patrolling. It's me in my uniform. They don't have to observe any room. Man, today was crazy day, man. Uh, oh, there's there's a noise complaint, so I go to the room, I knock on the door, I tell them to keep it down. And that guy is like six foot two bodybuilder I told him hey you know shut it down and you'll be quiet and they're fighting with me so oh my god he was yeah so now I'm going to the man these patrols yeah this we got an idea We're going to the third level. This guy stands. I'll be out in the parking lot soon. I need to make patrol over there. So this one is like almost done. This 
what I call the floor walk. I don't know many of this job is for me. Now we're gonna go to the sample room and it's, that's a room like it's like a, a preview of what it's gonna look like when it's finished so I will show you that look at this this is like what's that game uh, Outlast this is like Outlast man if some ghosts pop up here I'm gonna shoot them oh my lord oh I'm so tired what a day today, man. What a day today. So let me check these rooms really quick. I have a quite trouble putting my flashlight on. Wait a minute. Okay, sorry about that. I'm going to enter this. An access key over here. So it's open now. This is the door. Oh, so this is the closed one. That's the dark one, sorry. Go to the other side. And this one. I think this one is open. Okay, here we go. You can see this room are very nice. Look at that. This is a nice suit over here. Get a TV, sink over here, a closet, and then there's a light in here. Oh no lights, no lights yet. Look at that bed, the light. It's a nice room. That's me over there. Yeah, all geared up. Look at me. Hello. I don't know how long I can last on this job. This is it. This is the TV. Yeah. Oh my god, what did I do? Anyway. So. I'm gonna go downstairs now and later on I will do a video. Okay, my patrol is done. Adios. Hey, what's up? So, today is November. I forgot. 10. November 11, Sunday, 12.13 a.m. And I've been working 10 to 11, 11, 12. So it's been two hours and 15 minutes since my ship started. And what a day today. Uh, you know, I did some uh, support services like delivering bed sheets and delivering letters. And, and yeah, I... Also, uh, I also did a confrontation today with the guests in room 337. It was a noisy, loud guy, six foot two, masculine guy, and man, he is drunk. And the next door was complaining that they're making it, but I don't like confrontation, you know. So, but. I don't want to shoot and kill people if they go violent, so then I, I will end up in jail, so I always call my boss and say, what do I do with this situation? I hope there will be no more incidents of noise or, or anything like that. I also encounter some people in the pool, 
so I told them, you know, pull his clothes, and yeah, so that's about it, and okay then, uh, and this is the lunch room, right here. I work at night time so there's no food. It's supposed to be like buffet for the employees. And that's the soda machine. But I'm not gonna drink a soda right now. I'm just gonna drink a cold water. Let's see. Right here. Press cold over there. that cold so ah. what a day today my god to be honest I really don't know what to do anymore I don't know man I, I'm thinking, should I go back and hide, build servers, putting screws, or, you know, stay here. I have one more night, you know, I don't know what kind of things will happen today. So, yeah, you can see my face, you know, I'm kind of worried. I don't know if this is the job for me. I mean, there's a lot of security job out there, but this one is different. You're alone, and you know, you need to be confront confrontation to people. And, you know, my boss is an ex-police officer. He had a gun, he had a taser, but me, you know, I'm not an ex-cop. You know, he had the experience how to deal with people, but me, if I get scared, then I'll still just start shooting. <sighs> yeah. So, let's see what happens. I got 1220, the 120, five more hours. Okay, then I'll keep you updated. And maybe I'll do a patrol and I'll bring the camera over there at the patrol area, the parking lot that I patrol. Okay then, adios. This is the area I patrol in. Side. Ooh.
Hey, how are you? Uh, how are you? Today is November 11 actually of 6.49 a.m. I just came out from work. I am really really tired. This is the first time I've been working seven days in my life. I think the longest I worked was nine days straight. And this one I worked for seven days. Oh wow. And tomorrow will be my seventh day and just ooh, I think I cannot do this job anymore. Earlier on my job I have to deal with the noise complaint. And you know I went there. I hate it when I have to deal with noise, you know. Okay then. So tired. Adios. Hi, today is November 12, 7.27 a.m. and I just got out from work. I just finished my uh, five days work and I'm really really tired because I've been working for seven days. I work Monday, Tuesday in Hive and then Wednesday to Sunday to the security job. So. And you know, let's see how the days go because I'm deciding to quit this uh, job and go back to Hive. And let's see what happens. Should I go back to Hive or not? I do not know. Because you know, this job today, uh, on Wednesday, Thursday, there's not much problem. And then. Friday was really good, but Saturday, you know, I have to deal with noise complaint, then deliver something, and then Sunday was really calm today, you know, no problem at all. But, you know, I, I really don't know if I, I want this job or not. I'm just so tired, okay? Adios. Hi, today is November 13, 2018 and it is around 3.05 p.m. It's my day two of my day off and I just uh, went to the I went to the dealership to tune up my car and you know I'm still waiting for that call where when it's ready to pick up my car when it's already done and after that put gas maybe clean buy some food and then you know do some laundry and and then you know enjoy my day off my last day off because my off is Monday and Tuesday on the security job and on I decided to stay one more week let's see what happens I was gonna quit uh, last week but I said you know give it a chance because on Sunday it was calm you know there's no noise complaint or unruly guests so I'm gonna give it one more week and you know if, if I like it then maybe I stay so or maybe I will be back in Hype solution on Monday. All I need to do is, you know, have always have a 9.5 hours of sleep as much as possible. I think that's what I'm gonna do. But anyway, uh, yeah, I'll keep you updated. So I, I guess uh, my my job. Uh, the security is still continuous. Okay then, I'll keep you updated. Adios for now. Hey, today is... what's up? Oh, my, my eyes twitching in this side. Today is November... 
November 15, 6:53 a.m. I just uh, I just and and my ship just ended 53 minutes ago at the hotel, and you know I was thinking to you know to quit last week, but I decided to come today. But today was very good at work, you know, nothing, nothing, uh, uh, man, I'm so sleepy, uh, nothing, there, is, there was no bad situation. I got there and there's this new manager, not new manager, I mean, this is the first time I saw him. He's a black guy and he, he did everything. I mean, there was no, I didn't give him lunch break. There was no uh, support services. It was a very quiet, uh, calm night. But my supervisor also arrived today and he stayed for me for two hours. We did some paperwork and in the parking lot we kind of see someone uh, staying on the car for loitering or something like that. And yeah. But today was a good day. But I don't know for the next four days if it will be good or not. If everything is good, I might stay on this job and I will not go back in hype. I don't know. So, again, that is that's what happened on November 15 at 6:53 a.m. So, see you then as this as this story continues. And I got home today, and there was no food. So, you know, I'm pretty upset about that and. I'm thinking what I'm gonna eat. Okay then. Uh, see you again tomorrow. Hello, today is November 16, 6.41 a.m. I just got out from work and it's my third third day of the second week and I have to go back in Hive on Monday and that's where I decide whether I stay on Hive or stay on this job so yeah today there's a lots of uh, incident I, I guided a drunk person on his room and then the support services front desk uh, I was it was too much. I hope that you know tomorrow and in the coming days it will not be like that. So let me see. Resign or stay, I don't know. I cannot make up my mind. Okay then, uh, see you on the coming days. I'm so tired and I have a lot of things to do, so adios. Hi, today is November 17, 2018. It's around 6.41 a.m. I just got out from work and, you know, today there's a lot of happenings. And, you know, I, I was in the front desk because the shuttle driver did, didn't arrive to, to uh, to bring the flight attendants to the airport and then I also saw a, a guy entering an employee entrance door and, and I assisted a guest I jumped uh, his car yeah those kind of things and you know I got two more nights and I don't know what will happen and let's see what will happen okay then adios So today is November 18. November 18. Uh, November 18, 6:39 a.m. I just got out from work 39 minutes ago, <coughs> and tomorrow is my uh, end of the day. I mean, that's my five days on uh, Sunday. It will be two weeks of work, so I have to return in Hive on Monday 
and if I decided to return then I don't know which one should I stay on this job or resign on Hive uh, and that's tomorrow because I will get out tomorrow 6 in the morning Monday so it's a big decision to make so you know, so far today was not so much nothing happened it was you know it was calm it was it was cold and it was good you know I hope it always like that every day but when something happened and that is the big problem so okay and you know what a journey and uh, we'll see if I should go on or not so far I feel like you know half of me saying you know stay on this job you know take it you know I'm waiting for my taser and then and then sometimes you know half of me saying leave this job and go back to hide ah, we'll see what will happen let the Lord Jesus and God the Father Almighty and Holy Spirit guide me through this and we will see which one should I stay or which one would I go okay then adios Hi, today is November 19, 2018 and it is 6.41 a.m. And you know, I decided to go back to Hive but still not resigning here in, in this company. So, you know, I, I really hard to decide because right uh, today I work and at the beginning of the ship my CEO and my supervisor was there they talked to me about my concern about uh, confronting people and forcing uh, rules so they give me carriage you know but you know for them it's like they, they make it sound so easy but for me confronting people and forcing uh, rules it's just not my thing because you know I'm a shy person I have social phobia and you know I don't really uh, I'm not into that kind of thing so well uh, the payment is the same you know in, in, in the job I have been hired and, and this company right here is the same pay but the difference is here there is no pressure of you know building chassis and no you know like I'm my own so yeah it's hard to decide you know if I go back and hide I'll have a four days off if I go here I just have the regular two days off Monday and Tuesday and I will be working Thanksgiving and I will be paid double so overtime pay so I don't know and you know I have only a few hours to wake up and go in in hype so I cannot believe that you know I will be after missing for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve days, and I will be back there again. Like wow, you know, I'm supposed to say goodbye, goodbye to this company, no more me. But then I have to. Oh my God, yeah, yeah, it sucks. But let's see what happens. You know, okay then, I have to take shower, eat and sleep and then wake up again and go to Hive and I'm up on this company right now for two days and I can decide whether I stay or leave still can't decide after 12 days you know sometimes this company right here when there's nothing going on it's it's a good job you know you walk around uh, patrol this patrol that but when there is an incident that's the problem that's the problem when there is incident like there is, you know, there's trouble, you know, there is a noise complaint or there is a customer who, or a guest who doesn't follow rules, you know, things like that. And, you know, I have to handle it because I'm the only security. Okay then, so much stress right now, so let's see what happens and, you know, I hope that God will give me an answer, you know, which one is best for me. Okay then, adios.